my name is Lashi and today I'm here in my medieval world to show you how to make a village house and I'm just going to be adding it right here and you can just follow me along and build it for yourself if you want so let's just see what materials I'm going to use I think I'll use some spruce wood and some oak wood planks I'm going to also be using some cobblestone some dark oak fences and I think I think some oak wood stairs and some oak wood slabs that's all I'm going to be using for now so first thing I'm going to do sorry for the noisy water I don't know if that's loud or not first thing I'm going to add a spruce wood there with two gap spruce wood two more gaps there and another one there so that's four now I'm going to just repeat this to make a square there there and there that should be right and I'm just going to do this the whole way okay I'm actually going to put this over here so on the inside layer I'm just going to be putting some cobblestone like this uh, there we go now let me just do this quickly yeah. there we go I am going to just extend these up by four I think two three no, three is fine. Okay, extend all these up by three. Okay. Now I'm also just going to raise the cobblestone up. There we go. One more layer. There we go. Okay, I think that's quite fine. Now I'm going to take the slabs and just put them in between all the gaps on the top, like this. You can just go around the whole thing. And what I like to do with houses, if I just show you over here, I like to kind of make a platform going up and then I put the house on it. So I'm going to be doing that with this as well. So I think that's alright. Now I'm just going to bring this around one more time, I think. Mm, I think that's okay. Alright, now I'm going to just put some spruce wood on each corner. There we go. And just put two in between like this. Just directly in between the two in the middle. It's not difficult. There we go. I think that is okay. And I'm just going to use some fence to bring this this down. Okay. And so just break the corner slabs and then just bring the fence going down. You don't have to do everything that I'm doing. You can change it to make it how you want to. I'm just showing you how I like to build. But you don't have to do the same thing. Okay. Yeah. It's quite tricky to place fences sometimes. Okay, I'm just going to neaten this up a bit. Um. Okay, that's better. There we go. Last one. And 
Come on. There we go. Okay. I think that's about right. I'm going to add some oak wood stairs at the bottom just because it looks nice. Okay, I think that's quite alright. And I'm going to do the same at the top. There we go. And then we'll just fill in that little gap with some slabs again. Okay, that's looking good. Let's just fill it in with the slabs. There we go. And go all around. Ah. Try not to do that. Okay. I think this is looking quite decent. Now I'm going to get some some white hardened clay as you can see I've done it in some of my other buildings it's kind of I think it is actually clay what they do that clay wall that they have in those medieval buildings I don't know how to explain it but there's this white wall in between so what I'm going to do I think let me just see Okay, I'm going to do some wood again over here. And we're going to raise that up by two more again. So raise all the poles up by two. And then just in these corners also raise it up. Okay. Okay, hopefully you can see what I've done there. Now I'm going to just add in all of this with the uh, uh, white clay. Okay, and then just fill it up all the way to the top. Okay, now I'm going to take the oak wood planks and just do it over like this. Okay, now I'll take some stairs and just put it over everything like this. Cool. Now that we have that, this is going to be the next floor. So I'm just going to make a pattern going around like this. So just fill all the sides with the spruce wood and then we'll fill in the middle with some oak wood again. Okay, now I'll get the planks and just fill it up. I'm not going to show you any interior because I think it's better if you just design it yourself to make it more personal. Okay, I think that's cool. Now I'll just put the spruce wood on the corners again. And we're going to bring those up by two more. So it's three blocks high. Okay, now we are going to just uh, place these blocks like this. So there's going to be one gap, and then the pole, then, uh, then one gap, and then the poles again. So like this. And just do that all the way around. So a gap, then a pole, gap, pole, gap, and then two poles. Okay, gap, pull, gap, pull, gap, 
Apple Gapple There we go Now I'm just going to fill this up at the end again with the white clay Well actually that's going over the pattern design there so I think Ah, uh, it's fine I'll just make it go over Okay, and then you're just going to raise that up with all the rest of the poles Last layer Okay There we go Now we're almost done, I'm going to be doing the roof quite soon I'm just going to add this part here, so just go over all the hardened clay with the uh, oak wood the oak wood planks, like this and then for the sides I think I'm just going to add a wooden slab on each of these poles like this Now I'm going to start the frame for the roof So I'm just going to start after the first block there And just go all the way in the middle Then just keep doing this until it makes the triangle shape Like that And I think I'm going to raise this up a little bit more There we go And just do the same on the other side Yep, that's right. Now, I think I am going to... Yes, just uh, add, add those corner bits there. Sorry. There we go. Now to do the actual roof. I'm going to put a oak wood, uh, oak wood plank here. And then just go up by two. So on the side one two, on the side one two, and one two. Then you're just going to go on all of this like this. There we go. There. Now I'm just going to add one block coming off on the side like this. There we go. And you're just going to add your stairs coming on the side of those blocks like this. There we go. Up. Huh. No. <laughs> stairs can be tricky sometimes. There we are. Okay, let's see how that looks. Yep, that's looking good. And we are going to make a overhang over here. I'll show you what to do now. Let's just finish these stair bits off. Okay. Now take your oak planks and we're going to just make this overhang like this. And do the same on the other side. Cool. And I think that's looking quite good. What else could we add? Hmm. Nope, I think that's fine just like that. So there you go, you are finished now. Thank you for watching this video, I, this tutorial. I hope you enjoyed it very much and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!